Welcome back one and all to another episode of Tuesday's Q&A. This is spare time in the Q&A HQ and I've realized something. I like standing on things. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we did not get any questions this last time, so I actually pulled one out of the archives to answer because we moved into the new snapshot. Let's see, we've got skeleton eggs and the question here was from Jake Irwin. So this is Tuesday's Q&A for July 15th, 2014 from Jake Irwin. Do the new snapshots change the number of mobs needed to get to level 30? Very good. We got to go back and answer this one. I think we had that one. It was over here. Let's go check the book out. Let's see. Mobs and Cane, Pigmen and Cousins, Secret Settings, Glowstone, Mobs and Levels right there. There it is. This was from April 8th, 2014 from Bizrebellion. Oh yeah, this is the one he asked about the number of blocks in Minecraft. Funny guy Biz is. Biz is. But he was actually asking, how many mobs does it take to get to level 30? It said, we found out it takes about 110 mobs to get to level 30. I'm not going to do the 50. The 50 is not needed anymore. But we're going to do the level 30 here. All right. I'm going to take this. Okay, let's put this back. There we go. All right. Here we go. We are going to head over to the mob grinder that we built for the last one and use that one again. So I'm going to head over there and you guys come back when I get everything set up. Okay. See you soon. Do you guys remember this place? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, here we are back in the in the grinder here to check to see how many mobs it will take to get to level 30. See if it matches what we did in the last update. All right, this is the current snapshot or one of the current snapshots. I think it's uh, 14W25B is what I'm working in right now. So let's try this one out. We'll get a 110 skeletons there. I'm going to block this up here so that we can stay safe because I am currently in survival mode so that we can see what levels we get here. All right. So let's get started. We will put in the 110 skeletons here. We'll go through these and see what level we get to. Ready? <laughs> well, this is working well. Um. I need to check this. Um, be right back. Okay. I got it fixed. Maybe. Maybe. All right, let's try this again. 110 skeletons. Well, I'm still in creative. There seems to be an issue here. But I think. You're not going to get the XP when you go back into survival. You don't think so? No, you We're going to give it a try. We're going to give this a try. If not, I'll have to record it again. Alright. Storm's back. Let's finish this up. Last few. Very noisy storm. There we go. 110 skeletons. 
Let us see what Let us see what we get if we change over to survival. Twenty-three levels. Ah, uh, look at that. So it doesn't get we got, we did a hundred skeletons and only got to twenty-three levels now. So it does change. One hundred and ten. Thank you. I got corrected. All right, we're gonna need some more skeletons now. More skeletons. That's what we need. More skeletons. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven out of 32. So it gives us 25 more. So that's about almost exactly 200 now. We'll round it off. Say 200 is what you need now in order to get to level 30. All right, but we got to check something out here. Hold on. We got to check something out. I need to go. I wanted to find out one other thing here. If I use this to enchant now, how long will it take me to get back to level 30? All right, hold on. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I've got myself a diamond sword here with some lapis because in the new snapshot, you have to use lapis in order to get levels. I've got 30 levels. I need to do one, two, three pieces of lapis and I get the 30 levels there. Smite four. All right, let's see what we do here. If we do this, watch what happens. Knock back two. That's a pretty good sword right there. Not bad. But if you look, number of levels, 27. It only takes off three levels. So it makes it easier to go back and get up to level 30 to enchant again. Let's find out how much that would take. All right, let's seal this back up here. There we go. Let's put in, let's put in 16. There it is, three more. So we did 32 plus eight, so we did 40 more. So it took 40 more to get back to level 30. All right, um, let's get out of the storm and go back and get this thing taken care of. I'll meet you back at HQ. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Another question to put into the Q&A library here. So let's fill out this book and write another one off. Tuesday's Q&A, July 15th, 2014 from Jake Irwin. Do the new snapshots change the number of mobs needed to get to level 30? Yes. It now takes about 200 mobs to get to level 30. And done. Okay, so with the new snapshot, it's going to take more mobs to get to level 30. But as you saw, you're only going to need 40 to get back up to level 30 each time. So in the long run, the more enchanting that you do once you're at level 30, the more that you will be able to, uh, the less mobs it will actually take in order for you to be able to keep doing level 30 enchantments. So there you go. If you have your own mob grinder, that's how you can set up in the new snapshots. So thank you very much, Jake Irwin, for giving us another this question. And everybody, leave me your questions, your good questions, fun questions, little questions, big ones, whatever you come up with so we can ask the new questions in the new snapshots. All right, everybody, we will talk to you later. Thanks, everybody. This is Spare Time signing off from HQ, and we will see you next time. Bye.